hi guys welcome back to this week's vlog and oh my god my forehead my forehead looks massive anyway whatever this week's vlog is super exciting because it is like the prep official prep and build up for the splendor vlog which i'm hoping i'll be able to do properly because i don't know about bringing my camera many places at splendor because i don't want it to get ruined and i'm not going to be in the right state of mind to look after my camera today is saturday and we have been out this morning it's now like five in the afternoon but we've been out this morning me and gary getting a bunch of different things for Splendor. So I'm gonna show you what I got today. This thing I got was a little mirror that I can use to do my makeup in the mornings. I just got one with a little stand because I literally have nothing like this besides my circle mirror thing that I use in my beauty room, but it felt like it was a bit bulky. This one's just flat and I can just chuck it straight in my bag and it's small and thin. So I thought that was a lot easier. I got some crew socks so these long ones because i'm going to be wearing boots the whole time so i need socks that will cover the um like go over the top of the rim of the boots so i don't get blisters or anything got some boob tape because i don't intend on wearing a bra the whole time so i got a few of these and i've got a few extra in my drawer already so i just had to get a few extra just so it'll last me the whole time these things are the bomb i get them from bras and things and they literally just tape right onto your boobs and they lift your boobs up and also it works as like a nipple cover I guess as well so I also got two pairs of Spanx I don't have any in the black color I got the exact same ones already except they're in the beige color so I got a couple of those and I also got lightly scented family wipes so they're just essentially like baby wipes just to do a quick little once over if I'm not able to get to a shower as rank as that sounds. Gary got a new pair of your hair. <laughs> what is happening with your hair? <laughs> Look at the new sunnies. So cool. Get your shirt out. What's it called? Dashiki. Dashiki. He plans on wearing it when we see schoolboy Q. Take your time, doll. It actually looks so cool with the sunnies, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> You cool guy. I just hope you don't get beaten for like cultural appropriation. We're gonna go get some dinner now because I have started to eat proper food instead of doing my shakes as much. I'm still gonna do them Monday and Tuesday because I'll be working those days so it's just easier. Today, this afternoon, we have been doing this. And to the untrained eye, this looks like a bottle of Lipton raspberry iced tea. I mean, in actual fact, it's half full of alcohol. But the lid is sealed. We're evil geniuses. <laughs> so we've got three each of those that we're going to take with us. Secret squirrel business, hey? Mm -hmm. No one will ever know. Because all the caps are sealed. I still can't get over how clever that is. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that, honey. <laughs> Could have broken my lens, you freak. Hi guys, welcome back to another clip where I have my hair up in a hive, which is super, super attractive, but it's just a really convenient time to film once I get home from gym and just before I'm about to go to work um, because I'm just sitting here watching YouTube videos. Um, but today is Monday. I don't think I've vlogged at all yesterday, but I guess you would have seen a few seconds ago if I had or not I just don't remember I all I did yesterday was watch Game of Thrones I don't think I did oh yeah I got my nails done and the the color just doesn't look as good on camera so it's just a nude a nude color I got the coffin shape they're a bit more wide than what I usually get but these are the SNS nails and I this is the first time I have gotten them and I love them. They're a lot thinner than your usual acrylic, which I love. And they're way better for your natural nails, apparently. Um, I guess there's less chemicals or something, I think the lady was saying. Definitely going to be getting SNS nails from now on. This afternoon, I'm getting my hair done, so I will be showing you guys what it looks like. I'm not getting it cut or anything. I'm just getting the color redone, which I'm really excited to have that really dark, like, black-brown hair color again. 
Oh God, I'm so tired. I get up every Monday and Tuesday at 4.40 in the morning so I could go to gym and then I start work at 7. I will see you guys in the next clip when I have my brand new hair. Oh, so excited. Good morning, everyone. And today is Tuesday morning, so it's the last working day I have. And then tomorrow we're going to Splendor. This is my new dark hair. Um, I'm looking very <laughs> emo kid at the moment because my skin is so pale. But this afternoon I'm going to be tanning and it's going to look so good with the tan. Um, it came out, you can't really tell on camera, but it came out a little bit blue because she put in a blue undertone. Um, that's really just because she made it darker than I initially wanted it just because it will fade a bit. So it is very dark. Update. I don't think I'm going to be vlogging at Splendor this year simply because leading up to it I've been so stressed out thinking you know how am I going to be able to film this am I going to get the right footage is it going to be you know what I want it to be in the end result and I just kind of decided the whole point of Splendor is to go away for a holiday and I want to be able to be able to relax and have fun and not think about anything other than having fun so I'm sure no one's really going to be bothered that I'm not doing it, but I just, because I've been saying that I'm going to vlog it, I figured I better say that I'm not now. Um, I'm going to leave my camera at home, also because I just don't want to take my camera there when, you know, there's tents, people might try and, you know, it could get lost, it could get stolen, it could break, it could, God knows what. And I will just have to tell you guys all about it when I get home. And I'm really hoping that I can get this vlog up before I go away because I have a whole lot of stuff to do this afternoon. I have to go to the shops, get a few last minute things and then I have to come home and tan and pack and organize and everything like that. So I'm very stressed out at the moment trying to get everything done. You know, if I want to upload this video, I'll have to edit it tonight as well. So it's either going to be a very late night or, you know, I won't get the video done. I guess we shall see. Anyway, I'm going to be heading to work soon, so I have to get ready. So I may sign off this vlog later on this afternoon. Well, well, well. Look who it bloody is with a fucked up tan. Ah, oh, so if you couldn't tell by my visual appearance, I've just walked through the door, just got home, from Splendor, literally. I haven't even peed yet. There's my bags. I'm so tired. Okay. I don't know where I last left off on this vlog. I really don't know. I'm so lost in where I'm up to with updating you guys. But I don't know if I said this already, but I didn't end up vlogging Splendor because after everything, there was a lot going on. I wasn't going to be able to charge my camera if it ran out of battery. It would have been a big effort to try and find a way to charge it. Uh, there wasn't going to be a lot of opportunity for me to be able to film because I'm not 100% comfortable with vlogging in front of people yet. I mean, I'm still kind of shy when it comes to vlogging in front of Gary. So I was in a group of like a bajillion people. And so I figured I wasn't um, yeah, going to do that. So... And then also, I, f I was not able to upload my vlog before I left. So, this vlog that you're watching right now is before I went to Splendor and right now when I'm getting home, which I am stopping the vlog right here after I kind of give you a rundown. So, basically, it was so much fun. First of all, I had such a great time. Um, had a really good group of people there with me. I feel very puffed. It was really cold. Like, not ever been that cold in in my life. Mine and Gary's mattress also kept deflating. It was such a cheap, you know, inflatable mattress from Kmart. So I'm not really surprised. But we basically slept on the hard floor every night and we were there for five nights so that was a bit of a time but 
trying to stay warm was really, really hard. So I basically slept, like for example, last night I slept in um, my workout tights, tracksuit pants, two pairs of socks, one of them being bed socks. Then I wore a big bulky jumper and a poncho to bed with my hood up. That's how cold it was. And then we had two blankets over the top of us in this tiny cold tent on a deflated mattress. So it was so uncomfortable. I'm gonna be really, really well rested tonight. I'm gonna have the best sleep of my life tonight. It's gonna be fucking brilliant. All in all, it was so good. It didn't rain once. It was just very, very cold and windy the first day. The first day to set up, it was so fucking windy. There was um, tents flying. There was people's gazebos flying through the, through the wind. People having to chase after all their shit. But other than that, it was such a good time. And, and we got to see all the bands I wanted to see. I saw All Day, I saw Catfish and the Bottleman, I saw Schoolboy Q, which was really good. I saw the XX, Gary's Home. I'm just giving the vlog a rundown. Current situation. <laughs> you gonna vomit? Okay. Anyway, I'm gonna leave the, the vlog right here and I will see you guys in the next one. Gary's just throwing up. Oh, okay. And on that note, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.